大阪 is a food paradise. Anywhere you go, nice and cheap restaurants are there. Today, we're gonna share recommended food you should try here in Osaka. Osaka is a designer city in the Kansai region and also recognized as the second largest city of Japan. It has been known as a commercial district since a long way past and also famous for culinary. If you had to say Tokyo is the economic and political capital, Osaka is the food capital from my perspective. So today, we're gonna introduce some of the foods you should have when you stay by Osaka. The first one on my list is Gogoichi. Gogoichi is a Chinese style restaurant, but you don't eat in. It's kind of like a souvenir shop. Many people who were raised in Osaka grew up with this restaurant. The most popular one is Butaman. Butaman is a steamed bun with minced pork filling. This butaman is only obtainable in Osaka, totally irresplaceable. This is a mess when you come to Osaka. You can't experience the same flavor anywhere you go in Japan. It's all prepared in a shop one by one. The meat bun outside is very thick, soft, and a little chewy. You should dip mustard on it and dig in. The second one on my list is takoyaki. Takoyaki is the dumpling putting octopus inside. There are some kinds of takoyaki in the Kansai region, but Osaka is the hometown of it. One of my recommended takoyaki restaurants is Hanadako. Hanadako is next to the Osaka station. Once you step outside of the Midosuji Minamiguchi, you can find it soon. It's a standing style restaurant and a characteristic atmosphere in Osaka. While you are waiting in a line, you can watch how they make takoyaki. The most popular one is Negi Mayo. Tons of green onion are topped on takoyaki, but it's not pungent at all. I've never seen such a good combination ever. The third one on my list is Kushikatsu. Even though Kushikatsu strictly means deep fried pork, you can try so many flavors such as vegetables, cheese, and even sweet sometimes. The best part of kushikatsu is its cheap price. Each one is around 100 through 200 yen. It always satisfies the people in Osaka. One of my recommended restaurants is Daruma. It's the most popular and famous restaurant serving kushikatsu in Osaka. In most kushikatsu restaurants, you have to follow the simple rule. You mustn't soak your skewer in the thick sauce twice. If you wanna put more sauce in it, you can use free leaf your cabbage like this. It's the one I always have when I go back to Osaka. The fourth one on my list is a cheesecake made in Rikuro Ojisan. Rikuro Ojisan is a confectionery devoted to cheesecake. It has 10 outlets around Osaka. There are three features of this cheesecake. First, it uses fresh ingredients. They import cream cheese from Denmark and sells fresh eggs and milk which gives off an aromatic smell around this shop. Second, they sells raisin imported from California. They soak it into the homemade syrup which accents its flavor. Third, it's always fresh just out of the oven. Every single cheesecake is baked in the shop little by little, so you can get fresh one whenever you go. The texture is so fluffy and soft that it dissolves smoothly when you put it into your mouth. Definitely delicious. What we introduced today is just a part of it. Why don't you look for your favorite when you come to Osaka? I can assure you you can discover your own one. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this and want to know about Japanese culture from locals, please hit the like and subscribe. And see you in the next video.